Well, moving west this weekend, Fort New Salem is hosting a Hammer In weekend of workshops. Megan Hudock explains how volunteers at the event are helping to keep the ways of living on the frontier alive. Fort New Salem is a representation of a frontier log house settlement of the 19th century in West Virginia. This weekend, guests are able to learn about many trades done hundreds of years ago. It's nice to keep history alive and to, I think, to recognize how much easier we have it today uh, by knowing how to do a lot of the old arts. Pottery, basket making, paper marbling, and corn husk doll making are just some of the many workshops. The feature for the weekend was blacksmithing. I'm uh, teaching a basic blacksmithing uh, course here. It's, it's like blacksmithing 101. Uh, and it's teaching people how to make things that are durable goods. The, most of the things will last longer than they will be alive. Spinning is also one of the many arts featured. Uh, this is something that we really don't know when spinning was started uh, in history. I mean, it's pretty ancient. It's a pretty ancient art. Uh, it's an Appalachian art also, and this is how the yarn is made uh, from animal fibers or plant fibers. It's a great place to visit. Uh, we're all friendly people, and you come in and you can ask questions about any of the craftspeople that are here that are doing what they're doing, we're here to disseminate the information. That's the reason that I volunteer here at blacksmithing now. I've been a blacksmith since 83, that's 36 years. And I now give the information away for free in order to uh, keep it from the information from being lost. The event will continue 10 to 5 on Sunday. In Salem, I'm Megan Hudock for 12 News.